Yeah, what is it about the Welsh and horror films? Um, some good ones have come out in recent years, uh, and it seems that, um, I mean, you know, The Dark Hour, Feast, you know, these are good, these are good horror films. Not, maybe not great, but what do I regard as, uh, what is the criteria of a great horror film? That's a good question. I think you need to commit. Great horror films need to commit. The, the makers, the auteurs, um, and there, there are always there's always an auteur behind a great horror movie. It's always a single vision, um, a single vision, a director who employs people to fulfil his vision. Um, so they, but what is it about Wales and the heart? Well, I think there is a kind of there's there's a relationship between Welshness and wildness, isn't there? Dan uh, danger, psychological danger, and that's to do, I think, with the landscape. I mean, this is more psychology than culture, but there's there's a Raymond Williams crossover there, I'm sure. Um, so yeah, there are some there are some really good horror films, and I think that some f it's interesting some films that are not horror films are marketed with a, a with a taste of that. And some films that are not horror films, when you watch them, you realise that they are horror films, and I'm not sure whether they didn't commit to that because the people making them didn't know they were making a horror film. So that's, a, that's an, an obvious um, ingredient of, of something that is cultural rather than just a bunch of kids with a camera who, who want to scare people. And I think that's the difference. I think that's what Wales has. Um, there's, a, there's a cultural... Um, investment in the idea of the horror movie that you don't necessarily find uh, in other cultures. In many cultures you do, but not necessarily. Um, I think England is an interesting one. Uh, England has a kind of schlocky, uh, parodic relationship with the horror movie now um, that uh, the gothic has, has, has kind of dissipated with Hammer, um, you know, not, not doing that thing anymore. Um, I think that's England's authentic horror is, is the Gothic, whereas Wales is, is the, the Welsh horror is something to do with landscape, something to do with ancient law and uh, witchcraft and what is going on in those woods. And I think perhaps it goes all the way back to the to the establishment of the Mabinogi as a national literature um, and the, the horrific, strange, magical elements of that slowly over time have evolved into something more pointedly um, and structurally um, horror. Um, but yeah, I think, I think Wales is, like everything else probably, has yet to hit its potential, but it's definitely a land of horror. A land of horror, yes.